now. Hi guys, good morning. We are doing something a little bit different, taking the Imagine It segment on the road. We are down here at the Imagination Station. Of course, Carl Nelson, the old standby, still here. Hey, yep. Carl. Hello. So what are we doing today? We're going to talk about speakers. I mean, speakers are around us everywhere, whether they're the earbuds for your iPhone sure. or your sound bar or whatever. And so I've taken a speaker and actually sort of ripped it apart. Oh, okay. So it's kind of cool. So you have the sound cone there, right? Uh -huh. But then the real heart of it comes down to this tiny little coil of wire inside oh. and the big magnet on the back. Oh, okay. Right? So magnet, you, I didn't even know that. Absolutely. Most speakers will have a magnet and a coil. And what you do is you send a signal through this coil. Mm -hmm. The coil, the signal through it, and the magnet interact with one another. They put a force on each other. Mm -hmm. And that causes the speaker cone to vibrate. Sure. Now, I've got a, another little setup for you here. I've got a little hand crank generator. All right. When you crank this, you're going to send some electricity through these wires to this giant speaker. And so I want you to just kind of like scratch back and forth with it okay. and see what you can do. All right. <laughs> So you can see, as, as if you go one direction, go one direction, speaker goes up. You go down, speaker goes the other way. Yeah. Go back and forth, and you can kind of make what sounds like a little bit of music. So I feel like a DJ. A little bit. You're just kind of scratching the music yeah. there a little bit. And what's happening is that coil is interacting with the giant magnet on the bottom, okay. causing the cone to move back and forth. Wow. So essentially, this is what's happening when we have our earbuds in. Exactly. On a smaller level. On a much smaller <laughs> scale. And since it's right inside your ear, it's much louder. Sure. Now, it doesn't actually have to be as complicated as all this. All I mean, right. because that looks like that's a very nicely wound coil there, very fine wires sure. and whatnot. You can actually get away with something a lot simpler, and that's just a single piece of copper wire. Okay, and this we, might be something that we have seen maybe in a class in school. Yeah. They, they experiment with this type of stuff. And a really super strong magnet. Okay. okay, most of us probably don't have that around the house. Probably not, right. but, but you can get them pretty easily. Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this magnet right here, lay this right on top, and I've connected up a iPhone to okay. this amplifier, uh -huh. and I'm going to need our IT guy to unlock his phone. So John, go ahead and unlock your phone for me and get some music playing on there. I've got it connected to this giant amplifier. Okay. Okay. And once he gets the song playing, we're going to be sending a signal through this single wire. Whoa. Next okay. to the magnet. And my we don't, we toss this out, so that's no longer there. All right. My hope is that um, that is actually going to get working. But let's play Ooh. some music here. All right, just press play. I'm going to turn the amp on, uh -huh. crank it up, and we're going to get really close and see if we can hear anything happening here. Oh, you can. It's really, really hard to hear. Really and hard. that's because we only have a single wire. Okay. But if we take a lot more of that coil and make wow. it a lot bigger, sure. we should be able to amp up. The, the music coming out of this. We can get a lot more force on our piece right, so of it's foam still playing cord. right now, in theory. Still playing, okay. we get rid of that. And now, right. go ahead and hold that. Feel, feel what that feels like. Oh, wow. It feels like the bass is really vibrating the entire piece here. The entire piece of foam core is vibrating. In fact, you can even see some of the uh, foil is actually coming off a little bit yeah. as it starts to vibrate. Wow, that is okay. really cool. The science of music. And if you take it away from the magnet, it stops. stops completely. Bring the magnet next to it. Go ahead and take the magnet. You can actually feel the magnet vibrating as well. Oh, you can. And it gets louder the closer I get. It does. Wow, that it is does. really neat. So the, the science behind what's happening in all those speakers that in you see. In a speaker. See. It's a simple interaction between a current and a magnet. And it is actually something you could do at home. That's very cool. Well, this is home. Carl Nelson, yeah. thanks for joining <laughs> us. That is Imagine It on location today. And just a reminder, it is Saturday. That means that Lucas County residents that are 12 and under get in free with a paid adult. All right, and uh, just like Tina said, you get in free with a paid adult if you are here and you're going down to the Imagine It. There's some more times on your screen. Let's go to sports.